Hello everyone, welcome back to Bistro Buzz TV. Today we're going to be going to Dollar Tree and you can see that they have a lot of garland in stock. They have a lot of bows in stock as well. And then they have a lot of decorations to hang on your tree. They had just received a shipment, so it was really fun to go in and see what they had in their shipment and all the new items that they had out. Very well displayed. It was just easy to go and find everything. They had a lot of these ornaments here, you can use them on a tree or you can use them decorating in other ways. A lot of wreaths, very, very pretty. Just a lot of Christmas ornaments. And some of these you may notice that they had last year, some of them you may not. It's just interesting to see some of the ones that they did have last year because I tried to get some at the end of the season. They didn't have them, so I was trying to find the ones that I needed more of, but they had a very, very good display of items here at this Dollar Tree. They had a lot of candy too. You'll see in just a few moments some of the candy items that they had, but they were really stocked well with the candy. Again, here you see some of the wrapping tags that you can use on your gifts and a lot more Christmas ornaments. A lot of Christmas hats too. And here you will start going into some of the cards they had for Christmas. They had candy also, lots of candy. But they did have a lot of good selections of Christmas cards. So if you're needing a Christmas card, you may wanna try your Dollar Tree the prices are really, really good, and it's the same type of card that you would receive from other places. So you may want to check out your local Dollar Tree before you buy any Christmas cards. Here you'll find some of the ears you can wear during the holiday season. Really cute ears they had, and lots of candy canes. It was fun just to go in and browse, see what they had, and to see if they had anything that they had from last year out. They did have a few items from last year, but mainly a lot of these were the new items. Elf on a Shelf. How many of you do Elf on a Shelf? I've heard a lot of people are still doing that. I'm surprised it stayed a trend like it has, but if you do Elf on a Shelf, Elf on a Shelf, please leave a comment below and let us know how the elf does in your home. A lot of people put the elf and they keep moving it all the time with the kids. It's so cute. Lots of ribbon. You'll notice they had a lot of ribbon in stock. These houses that you're seeing here, you've seen them at probably other stores, but they're a lot more expensive at other stores. So if you need those homes that you want to display around for the holiday season, they're great, great little gifts. Buy some of those from Dollar Tree. You can use them as your Christmas items on the outside of your gifts. These items are really cute too. These were some of the items you could hang in your home. The top one said Jingle, very cute. And more wreaths, and they had these little doors just like this, they're miniature doors, and they had Joy Peace on them, they were so cute. Some gift bags. Then they had some signs that you could hang on your wall. Very pretty. I like these pictures as well. I've never seen these at, wall, at um, Dollar Tree before. Really, really like those. I wanted to get a few of those too, but um, I did not this trip, but I really, really like those. And more garland. A 
These were the two that I really, really liked. Really liked these, they were so pretty. They also had some coffee mugs that had the same kind of design on them, but they were bought out very, very quickly. I was not able to get any more of those. I love the little doors. I probably should have gotten one of those. I didn't, but they were so, so cute. I've never seen those before. But I think these were my two favorite that I saw. And these houses, I could not believe the price of these homes. They're, some of them are $1.25, some are $5, but they still beat the price at other places. And here you will find the two mugs that were really pretty and also the pot holders. And we're back to looking at a few items at the front of the store that we saw when we walked in. I just wanted to get another glimpse at these to see what they had in stock so I know what to do as far as coming back to Dollar Tree and purchasing additional items. Comment down below if you've already started your Christmas shopping or if, if you plan to cr finish your Christmas shopping in the next week or this week. A lot of people start early now. Some people start in October Christmas shopping and they already have their shopping done. That's not the way I usually do. The earliest I start the Christmas shopping is, in, is usually the week of Thanksgiving. And I have already purchased some things, but there's quite a number of things I've already purchased because I was so afraid they would get gone. But I've really enjoyed shopping this year. I've taken my time. I've been on evenings during the week when it's not as crowded. It just makes it for a lot more fun shopping. Thank you everyone for visiting Bistro Buzz TV. Please like and subscribe and come back to visit us again soon. Thank you.